Hi, my name is PJ and today we're going to be installing a pop and lock on this 2011 Ford Ranger. All right, now to start this, you're going to have to get to the back side of the tailgate so you can get to the latch. So we're going to take off this cover in order to do that. Okay, next we're going to take the scissor latch off the tailgate and you're going to use a 10 millimeter socket to do so. Okay, when you've taken off the scissor latch, you're then going to remove the tailgate handle from the front of the tailgate. You remove the dust shield from the latch, and then you're going to take the pop and lock, take the little L piece, go in between the bolt and the latch itself, and then just slide it on. And then you're given this extra little bracket that you're just going to slide over the other bolt so you'll get a nice flat fit, and then you'll reinstall the latch back onto the tailgate. Just reinstall the tailgate handle back in, make sure the bolts go back through the holes, and take the scissor latch and just re-back install it, getting the rods out of the way so everything goes back onto the screws or onto the bolts. And then just take your flange nuts and re reinstall them. Now if you pinch the scissor latch it makes it a little easier because it sits down further in to make it so you can put the bolts back on. Just snug them up. And then last, you're just going to reinstall the rods back in to the plastic cleats. And then just push the yellow clamp down, which secures them. To make sure it works, just turn the key. If it pulls out, it's locked. And then you just obviously to unlock it, just turn it, and you're good to go. And to complete the installation, you're just gonna put your covers back on the tailgate, and you're good to go. Thank you for joining me and have a good day.